Hey everyone, welcome to another video, hope you find it helpful. In this video, we are going to show you the easiest way to perform a classification. For this purpose, we perform the classification on the Landsat 8 image in ArcGIS software. We need to download the Landsat 8 image at first place. As a reminder, we've already recorded a video on how to download the Landsat 8 images. You can refer to that video if you don't know how to download the Landsat 8 images. After downloading the image, we can begin. Click Add Data in ArcGIS. Here you can see the image bands. Select the bands and import them to the software. Since the bands are separate from each other, they need to be stacked. To combine the bands, you can follow these steps. Select the Windows option and go to the Image Analysis. Select the desired bands. And click on the Composite Bands command in the end. The separate bands can be removed. You can choose a proper band combination to display the image better. Select an area to perform the classification on, here we randomly determine an area. Now we need to crop our area, but the shape file of the area is required to crop our area. So let's create the shape file for the area. At first, right click on a specific path. And select new and shape file. Assign a name for the shape file. Specify the feature type. Select the coordinate system of the image from the edit section. By clicking the import option, you can determine the coordinate system of the Landsat image for your shape file. Select Start Editing. Select the created shape file from the Create Features section. You can also determine the type of drawing polygon. Draw a polygon on your area. and click on Stop Editing. Search the Extract by Mask command from the Search section. Click on the command to be opened. In the input raster, choose your raster file. In the next section, choose your shape file.
Then specify an output path. Here you can delete the previous images and perform the classification on the final image. You can choose a proper color combination for your image. By right clicking on the empty part of the software, select the image classification command. Determine the image you want to classify. Here we have an image and it's been selected by default. Select the Training Sample Manager tool. Also specify the type of polygon drawing. Zoom in on the image and choose the class you want. Here we will select the farm class as an example. So we draw a polygon on the areas that are farm or we detect as farm. Be careful to choose the pixels that are clearly inside the desired class to have higher accuracy in the classification and reduce the errors. Sample from most areas. After the sampling of the farm class was finished, select all these samples. and select the Merge Training Samples command. Choose the appropriate color for the class. And write a name for the class. Also select the next class in the same way. After the sampling was finished, select the Create Signature File option and save the samples. You can choose different types of classifications from the classification section. Here we choose maximum likelihood classification. Enter the image in the first part. 
Enter the signature file in the second part. And finally click on OK. The classification was performed successfully. You can set a proper color combination for the classes. If you need to specify the area of each class, you need to first convert the classification output to a shape file. To do this, use the raster to polygon command. Here the raster image has been converted to a shapefile. Use the dissolve command to convert classes to each other. Here select the grid code to perform dissolve based on classification classes. If you need to have a field for the names of the classes, then you should use the add field command. Specify the name and type. Write the names of the classes. You can now change the image symbology based on each class. To calculate the area, you need to create a new field. After creating a new field, right-click on that field, and select the Calculate Geometry option. 